These are the poppers, air fryer edition. Final look, here's my plate. Back home, Thanksgiving three. I'm gonna start prepping the stuffing. I'll show you the spread right now. It's dope so far. Looks like we've got some turkey breast action that's already brined with the bone in, that's interesting. Some little quiches that look delicious. My grandma's homemade pumpkin pie. Don't know why I didn't save this for last. I don't know if these Ritz toasted chips are for this. So this is brie wrapped in pie dough. This is bomb, obviously. I don't need to say more there. And then I love jalapeno poppers. So jalapenos, cream cheese. It looks like different cheese. It looks something, unless there's hot sauce or, oh no, it's cream cheese and cheddar wrapped in bacon. And then I'll give a better view later, but these baked beans, I know this is not a normal Thanksgiving thing, but I definitely need to have these. I'm gonna work on the dressing now. Starting off with a little breakfast burrito, bacon, so I'm filming, egg, potato, sausage or bacon, cheese, flour for I got the hobs. No, I don't. I got the Tabasco. And I'll show you the uh, dressing, if you care. My grandma made these for the drive to Modesto and there's leftovers. I guess it's 10 a.m. Yeah, late breakfast for us, but got to fuel through the cooking. The quiche have started going. My grandma just said what they are, but I don't know. Florentine and cheese. Florentine and cheese. I have kind of dried out and these are like almost croutony before they get soaked. Cut my Definitely. celery and onions, gonna finish this and then start melting some butter in here. Eating the quiche. We'll go veggie first. What, you baked these before and then we're just eating room temp? No, I just, I just fixed them today. And that's a stick and a half of butter with celery and onions. We're gonna do a tablespoon of thyme tablespoon of rosemary, two tablespoons sage. Here's the thyme on the left, rosemary, which I went a little heavy, and then the sage on the bottom. Sorry, it's all mismatched. Gonna add this and then salt and pepper and chicken stock to the bowl of toasted bread. Now this is the bread, the celery, the onions, the thyme, the rosemary and the sage. Gonna add salt and pepper and then I'll show you the broth. Quick pause to her hand. I need 20 ounces and these are 14 and a half, so that's just annoying. So that is that. It doesn't look like there's a lot of liquid. Oven's preheating to 350. Now I'm going to whisk two eggs with the rest of the broth and I'll add it all together here and throw that in and then we'll eat soon. Well, not really, but the video. Oh yeah, that's cool, that's cool. So this is basically it. I'm gonna foil this, cook it for 40 minutes at 350, then uncover it to brown when we're ready to eat. All right, the dressing is in the oven. We're gonna prep everything else. The dressing just needs 45 minutes at 350 to brown and we'll get the beans going. We've got to make the turkey. That'll take 45 minutes. It's just turkey breast, not like a whole bird. Uh, we're going to air fry some jalapeno poppers, bake the brie. See you shortly. Getting my cycle on while we wait to eat. The girls are watching Gilmore Girls. Hi, Bailey. I am just waiting on the food to finish, watching the Warriors game. My phone is charging, let's go take a look at some of the food. All right, so this is my stuffing. Might throw it back in for a minute or two just to warm it up, but it is browned, it's ready to go. You've seen the pumpkin pie, the baked beans are good. I'm gonna dive into a deviled egg now. That's some cheese thing with some stuff. That was a great description. I'm gonna eat a deviled egg now. These are my fave. And the jalapeno poppers are getting air fried in here. Very excited. So we've got turkey breast in there, the brie pie wrap thing, and the pilaf. That is what's holding us up from eating. Right. Here's a deviled egg. These are, I guess, not traditional for everyone, but for me, Easter and Thanksgiving, always got to have the deviled eggs, and there's a little sriracha or something on here. Double leg dog. I'm just gonna eat another one. Mm. They might not be for everyone. I can probably eat these every day though. These are the poppers air fryer edition. I am very excited. We also have way too much food. I'm gonna be eating this whole week. All right, this is almost everything. You've already seen the stuffing. The brie and the pie crust exploded, but that'll be great. The mashed potatoes, 
The gravy just arrived. This is the peel off, another uh, staple for us that's not typical. You've seen the pumpkin pie, you've seen the baked beans and the deviled eggs. Here's a like half turkey or turkey breast or something with some skin. The jalapeno poppers from the air fryer and then some other things that have been left out. And then my mom made a salad. Apple autumn salad. Apple autumn salad, so we're all good. All right, this is the final, final look with the salad. Hope this thumbnail turns out. Let's eat. Here's my plate. We got all the things. I think the craziest thing is the inside of the brie. Maybe I'll hop over there. So yeah, you just see the brie and then some nuts in here. And this is just all brie, a brie little, a brie moat. And then some pie crust. I think this turned out well. We'll see how hard some of that is, but a lot of good looking things as Yunji assembles her plate. Let's eat. And then we're just gonna eat, y'all. Some salad to stay healthy. Nice looking plate, Nice. I'll go in on the jalap. Mm, it's crispy in the air fryer, not too spicy. You know me. The brie has come off the plate. Sorry. Just the dressing. Yep. Still like it. Dressing. You're stuffing with some bomb. I can't wait to try it. It's good. It turned out well. A meal that's got to be a meal itself. Wait, is this your first time trying the stuffing? Yeah. Yeah. I've never made it here. Cranberry on the mashed potatoes are really good, Grandma. And then the gravy is good too. Everything's good. It's all good. Let's go peel off. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Let's some other plates. Has their own. This is Yunji's plate. A lot healthier looking than mine. Oh, this is a good looking plate too. Yeah, they went a lot heavier on salad and crayon. Did either of you get turkey? Yeah, it's, it's yeah my turkey is <laughs> under the crayon. Oh, okay. Did yeah, the peel, the peel off took. Through? Yeah, the peel off it, turned out. I was afraid it wasn't cooking well, in there. We had so many things mm. going on. Mm. Baked beans. Uh, well, one fifty-four. We were close to two o'clock. Yeah. Half. <laughs> This stuff is great, too. Brie bomb. Mm. Usually too hungover to eat that. Sausage? Mm. Get yeah. it? It's good with sausage. And that would be just like a meal, just like a casserole. Yeah, when we were in Mexico last year, I made a type of dressing. <laughs> it didn't turn out like this. And then I think we did mashed potatoes and, and gravy. <clears throat> I made the mashed potatoes. And a lot of margaritas. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a video. I wasn't too far gone. Mm. All right, see you at dessert. I Reload. I wouldn't oh man, food coma. If you've seen all three videos, please let me know in the comments, either which Thanksgiving looked the most fun or which one you would want to go to or which one had the best food. We'll see you with more Mexico and LA content in the next few days. I'm probably going to put, post all these. I promise to start posting. I've got stuff, San Miguel, Mexico City, Vital Carmen. So stay patient. Let me know in the comments what content you want to see. We'll see you then. It's dark. Just having my last bite of pie. Just passed out. Slept four hours last night, so I passed that on the couch, but wanted to get the pumpkin pie on here. Mm. Pumpkin's sweeter and creamier than Costco and the other ones I've had. Mm, dope. Oh, the pie crust. Perfect. Mm. I'm getting the uh, you know, nutmeg and cinnamon. Definitely great goal.